All right, so here is the closet door. <clears throat> it would frequently get dark in there, even because this is the only light. There's no light inside. So I added lights inside. But where, you ask, are the lights coming from? I've got a five meter LED strip running along the edge of the door frame. Ah, sorry. All the way up, across the top, and then back down the other side. All the way down. I've got it held in with a bunch of these clips from Target. <clears throat> now the cool thing is, this is not on a s normal switch. If I close the door, pop, all the lights go off. Open the door, lights go on. Close the door, lights go off. Open the door, lights go on. So what I built was <coughs> a reed switch. This is a magnetic switch. There's a magnet in this 3D printed doorknob, door, door stopper, door jam thing. So when the door closes, that magnet gets really, really close to this glass tube, which has two small metal filaments in it that are just barely, barely touching when the magnet is removed. And when the magnet is added back, it forces those two metal filaments apart and it breaks the circuit, which turns all the lights off. And this whole thing is powered by a 10,000 milliamp anchor USB battery pack, which is sitting in a little container that my friend 3D printed for me. Same friend who 3D printed the door jam. This is all wired up to here. And then you can see back over here, it's wire, the wires are run all the way down the door frame. Bottom of the strip. Or the LED strip comes back up and illuminates everything. So, this 10,000 milliamp battery, I think, is probably going to last about six months between charges, which is pretty nice. It is very cold. It's not overheating in that container, which I was a little worried about. And now, all we have to do is close this and the lights turn off. And when I open it, they turn back on and illuminate the whole closet. Very nice.